there guys welcome to online hustles so on this channel we do how to make money online videos personal finance and personal development videos if that is your kind of content please consider subscribing guys help me grow and also help me reach as many people as possible click the red button click the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my videos so guys i keep uh, bringing new stories whether it is of me or other people what they are doing to earn money so that you can learn a thing or two and also do something worthwhile in uh, your life or something to help you earn money. So today we are talking about something different, how to make money, but now not online, but offline. So we are going to talk about Airbnb business. And I am joined by this beautiful lady here. She will introduce herself. How are you guys? I'm Lydia. From Tengela, I do property and BNB. Yeah, she's my friend leader, guys. She does Airbnb business. I actually didn't know that you could uh, actually have earn a living from this business until I met her. Well, I knew that kuna uh, Airbnb, but si kujua ni wenye mtu anezafanya yu biashara. Unajua? Ata si kujua ni uneza rent, alafu wewe rent. Exactly, yeah. Like you can rent somewhere and then... You also rent it out. Very true. Yeah, so Lydia, you can't do it. 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 You can't Nilikuwa napata clients wana kuuza Airbnb. Mimi ni mshamba. Unaona toka mtoto kutoka West Ham nikuuze. But na unajua kitambo by the way kulikuwa anga tuna guest house. Of course. Oh so my god. Simu zinapigwa reception. Wanasema wanataka kuwataka nyumba za Airbnb. Na shanga hizo ni nini? So nikakuja kujua Airbnb ni nyumba like a normal house eh. Yeah, yeah. furnish and then you give out to guest. Sasa mimi nikakuja. Kazi ni wakuja wa wakili like that. Yeah, 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 home. Yeah, away, away from, from home. Exactly uh, that's it. Sasa kwa moja nikakaa nikafikiria nikasema Mungu wangu this business i must lazima nianze kufanya hiyo biashara mm -hmm. though siko na capital that time i was earning only 10000 10000 yeah, my salary yeah, imagine yeah. 10000 10000 yeah. kenya shillings yeah you did my shit when you struggle and you are the breadwinner of any mm -hmm. yeah you have to do everything so nikajiambia siku moja nitaanza biashara so one day mm -hmm. nikapigwa simu simu ati there's another kamzungu coming yeah And then anyway, I was I was staying in like a one bedroom but in Kwani meka nyumba namba ya personal house. Yes. In Kwani meka tu mzuri. Of course hata kama mimi. And she has me. very good taste by yeah, the way yeah. guys. This girl, she can she can be an interior designer. Thank you so much. You should consider that thank too. You, thank you. Uh-huh. Sasa ni Kwani meka nyumba kama kanda go to house paying like 8000 but it was classy. Yeah? Mm -hmm. It was classy. Nikajambia, mbona nistoe nistoe mango kwa wardrobe na kila kitu? <laughs> Nipatie mtio hiyo nyumba now that it was nice. Aha. Nika try to manage Judy. That was now when they were in. Sasa zinaenda kuomba kwa family nilale. I went and slept in my friend's house. Oh, it was single. just one night. Yeah, it no. It was coming for two weeks. Wow. Nikaenda kwa beshta yangu, nikalala kwa beshta yangu usiku. So nilikuwa natendwa kwa most of my friends. Yule so, mmoja leo na lava kesho hapa. Mzungu <laughs> akuta akapenda house Judy imagine. That's how God works miracles. Yeah, yeah. I was so happy na kapenda kaka uko hivyo. I think I need to like it was it like 50,000 I'm like what? Mimi zaidi sikio pesa kama hiyo. 50,000 Kenya shillings yes. and you are paying 8,000 yes. rent. Hey. Wow. And then I was like no, now from there I need to open. Now a small like a bit sitter because yeah, I can yeah. start with that. Hiyo pesa yeah, hiyo pesa nilipatia I went to Judy then ka rent a small bit sitter. Mhm. Mm then ka furnish. That's where I started. So from there I know you know my houses eh from yeah, bed sitter yeah. one bedroom two bedroom three bedroom four bedroom now I think we have five bedroom yeah I mm -hmm. have like more than like 8 to 10 bedrooms eh you Just have to yeah 10 bed yeah, yeah oh, okay. tengela mm -hmm. now I want to start one in maybe maybe next year this year in Mombasa and Naivasha wow yeah that's my my plan yeah hey, that is a very yes. good growth Yeah. From from bed sitter now you you can you 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 can even hire five bedroom. So five what, what I want to tell people those ones that want to kwanza usikimbie na kitu kubwa. Unaona yeah. usikimbie na kitu kubwa. Hii biashara pia ni pole pole referral client amekuja amekujua hivyo hivyo. So usianze na kitu kubwa. Sasa unaona watu wengi wa Mazabi BNB ni wamefunga. Why? Yeah, They are starting with you high end. 
na una client you want to because other people are doing it and that's pia pia the same thing i always tell you guys by the way even online writing you just have to start from is true yeah you you, you you can't start from here because now i've had my fr- friends people who come to me like uh, uh, i want you to teach me this uh, online writing but now how much are you making and then when i show them they think when immediately they said they will start making that money it's true. It's true. there is no way you can start from up here you have to start from down it's there called gradually yeah, gradually. yeah. So and how do you get these clients? Yeah, mostly you do my clients. I give them I think it's referral, yeah. Yeah. Clients wana kuja. Mwingine akitoka anaambia mwingine there's a referral ina maanisha pia bila umeka nyumba yako unaona. True true. Client ata prefer if your house is what in good condition. Cleanliness mm-hmm. the first thing. Hizi nyumba zetu lazima uziweke safi. So me I try my level best kuka nyumba zangu nzuri you do. So I think referral and then he told you from the word god nilikuwa nafanya property yeah mm-hmm. so from there pia uh, i have your knowledge now class nilikuwa na sababu kitambo wana wanakuja mm-hmm. and then kitu kingine myself i go market you know i'm a marketer yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Marketer. you go personally to yeah i go i wow. go to this not to have like out of clubs yeah, hotels true, true. so sometimes i just like i walk in naonga nao waitress managers like i have this and this then when i take clubs sometimes i go to companies like mombasa road mm-hmm. na comfort small like that's that's where i get my long stay clients these companies because mm. like some engineers wana kuja kutoka machu they come for 6 months yeah. one year like how in one house i told you and the best the, the, the it by date can be so good if you can get a, a company that has uh, people coming in yes, from, so, from outside yeah i dwell in such companies na ndanga unanipatia hao watu na kana for maybe one year six months three months hiyo ndio ni kidogo wana napata so from companies marketing marketing dr yeah. man so at the end of the day, by the way it's not like you just have a house furnished no, and no, just no, sit no. back no yeah you have to it is still work by the way you yeah. still have to look for those clients yeah as i told you when i nikianza 2017 i was only one and another lady gold penina we are only two of us and that's 2017 yeah. but my friend right now everyone is doing the best to more than i think more than 50 we are many to do but no. imagine we still took out to another client yeah yeah sanje nilikuwa naambia watu usifungue to BNB kwa sababu unataka kufungua BNB lazima uifanyie kazi ama usifungue because you have heard that people are making money with it very, very, oh. by the way this is something that people need to learn Woo. mimi si nilikwambia nilifungua nga food business and i hope <laughs> nilifungua kwa sababu i had had oh you can never go wrong with food my mm-hmm. dear friend you can go wrong with anything okay if you open something because someone else is successful doing. with it by the way hmm. So okay competition is good Judy it's healthy it's yeah. healthy in our in it our keeps life. you on yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. but sasa usikuje tu kwa sababu ngine anafanya au kujitu ufungue you close men watu wengi baadaye Judy wa mfunga men of my friends that i know they've really close but wengine bado wanakuja tu na wanakuja leo na some they are doing good because wako na hiyo consistency na hiyo kwa kia that's it Judy by then i can tell you guys when you come to one of Lydia's houses i can yeah, i can assure you that you'll keep coming This girl has good taste like I said oh. and she also keeps her her however her house is very clean and Thank in you. very Thank good condition. You. Yeah. There is no way you can come back here and I keep saying that uh, the best mis- business is actually referral business. Very true. If you when you get that that client you have to treat them like you will never get another client very again. But you did like that class wengine. Yeah. Wanaweza kutusi but because uko na uweza hata kama umekosea imagine you did how to watu si imagine you just marry yawezi una zapata client and pass away even glasses maybe you have a client for party and you know because una mhitaji back you see na site you need you need something to cushion you ama una una like kwa mingi kwa hapo uziko akipasa maybe ni mingi maybe ni share hiyo ndio but maybe ni moja baby na ni client hapo ni frequency ndio pia hiyo kumjaji na most of my clients pia my friends yeah yeah with my friends so it's like that duty yeah how you treat them will determine yeah, if two. if one they come back and two if they will refer you very true yeah mm-hmm. so uh advice to anyone who is who wants to start this business yeah when you open duty wengi wanafanya mimi nasema kujeni kwa feel tukao wengi bora tu ujue what siwa ukuje ukijua tuko wengi na work hard weka nyumba yako nzuri na uanze pole pole usikuje yeah. na atumbaka kufungua five bedroom and start with a bed sitter yeah. one bed sitter the way i just said yeah. step by step step by step 
utapata clarity na tutakuwa tuta, tutafanya kazi pamoja mimi na karibisha i have good heart i'll give you clients referral but then most of my clients kitengela wao mfungwa bin biz na wapata clients nyumba zangu zikija na wapata come work together we are school women empowerment yeah? mm-hmm. women empowerment was sana tunatuma mwa na wake tuma mwa mm-hmm. but they pesa mwanaume judi <laughs> Just to work hard my dear. Yeah. Na pesa this, this is 2020. <laughs> yeah, we yeah, are no wow, longer depending exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. conference na kuja hapa kwa sisi hapa tutakuwa guest speaker. Yes, exactly. So uh, guys, I want to give you a tour of this particular house. Yeah. I just want to show you uh, how clean and how organized and uh, tasteful Uh, this woman is thank you yeah she's my woman crush today yeah yeah so guys i hope you enjoyed this tour don't forget to subscribe okay yeah yeah so go let's go so guys uh this is the door when you enter like this so you get this uh this is the sitting room I love the colors by the way. I really love the colors. I love I love bright colors. You can see how she has arranged here. So this is a this is the what is it called? The, the sitting room and the dining area. This is sitting room. No, no, no. This is not the dining. This is the dining. Yeah, oh, this is the dining area. Yeah. So this is the sitting area, right? Yeah, very beautiful. This is a it is a, a two bedroom house by the way. beautiful deco and this is the kitchen so she has a, she has put a, 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 a small fridge of course and then there is a cooker storage space as you can see and then now we go to the first bedroom which looks like it is the main bedroom by the way the master i told you she has class guys <laughs> she has very good taste you see that bed very beautiful very beautiful so that is the bed this is the window honestly speaking if you slept on this bed even if you have a uh, insomnia <laughs> ah i think for one night you'll actually enjoy it this is the storage space for this particular bedroom and then now we move on you can see this beautiful beautiful rug down there then we move to the second bedroom which is equally very beautiful and well arranged You can see the beautiful curtain and this is the bed. So like I said this is a two bedroom house. The storage space for this particular bedroom. Beautiful rug down there. And another one. And then finally we go to the bathroom. It is not too big but it is just uh it's a good size. It will do the work and it is also very clean like you can see. Yeah, so that is the bathroom. So guys, that was the tour. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh I hope you enjoyed the video in general guys and uh Lydia come say bye where are you oh, going thank you so much UD yeah UD. thank you so much for coming by the way oh, karibuni sana uni uni karibisha kwa one of these houses ni alilale tu unachua utaka gani 1 2 3 you will be so comfortable all <laughs> compound or apartment yeah 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 yani <laughs> ni la, ni lale from one bed to exactly, another exactly you know, just so that I can just feel good Imagine. because I don't know when I'll have a a, a holiday <laughs> So guys thank you so much for watching. I hope Bye. you have been inspired. Bye and uh, see you in the next video. Thank you so much. Bye. See you. Toodles.